I am having the slight suspicion that farming endgame levels expeditions won't be the way to go to get the apocalypse tier up to get ascension points and to get good loot. I have the slight su suspicion that this won't be the way to level 4 loot and apocalypse tier mostly. Yeah, good evening. That's not realistic. We are playing here more with the evenings da the shotgun that is pretty good and pretty strong even though all I need is the Emory Chaos because it just melts through enemies too quickly oh I still have loot I tried this expedition before and my game just froze well thanks for the two, two blue pieces of armor I have played like two to three raids so far and game expedition raids and I haven't gotten anything good from them even though I'm playing one level higher I have 51 gear and loot mostly and so far they haven't given me anything better in those expeditions than what I have before so I feel like leveling them may just be necessary for landing port resources but not for actual weapons and gear and yeah levels level ups which is a problem the other two expeditions I did both one level higher and what I am took me about 30 minutes solo which is a pretty good time I can't complain about that that's where it should be I feel like for our expeditions and I ran out of ammo that's a problem that only this gun will have I'm gonna fall back and get myself some ammo and hope that this time I won't just be glitched out incapable of doing damage oh Hey dude, the past each other was a weird moment. Like the, uh, the short moments when you pass someone and they both try to dodge in the same direction. We just one, had one of those moments. Yeah, this is good. There's nothing else to say about it. It sounds nice. Melts through enemies. Even through bosses. The only problem I always had with shotguns is that they run way too quickly out of ammo and that there aren't really good perks to solve that problem damn problem situation whoa dude just relax let's eat some twisted rounds This shotgun sounds so nice that you probably can hear my controller over it. Okay, I know some gas will come out of here shortly. Just let me get rid of the snipers of this side. And let's just surprise them. Oh, you bastards. Good luck that I ran out of shotgun ammo. Not really. Not really. Just one more coming out normally. Hey dude. Oh damn, I need to get cover. I need to slow trap it all the way up. Yeah, Emory Chaos is the way to go always. There we damn it. It's insane. And it never runs out of ammo. Pretty much, even with twisted rounds in it. Especially with twisted rounds in it. This gun will carry me all the way through the game. I don't even need to try out other guns. Shotgun is definitely nice. And I will play more with it. The secondary blue one. But it's ammo chaos all the way. Oh, more bosses just came up. These two almost. Then I'm gonna go all the way back to get some ammo. What? 
to slow plot my way through here. I mean, it's kind of insane, just insane. You don't stand a chance. Drama situation. Very wee situation. But it's one level lower than everything else. I got real lucky with that one. And I still would have gotten very far with the other guns I used. Let's see this next one. Slow grab. I didn't run out of ammo yet and I wanted to test this video for the shotgun. This is the real shotgun. I got them. Oh, I guess this is another Mercios video where I tell you how good this gun is and you all get... No. <laughs> I can ditch it again. The second time, what the hell game. Ditched again. No. The hell? Can I? Please. You bastards. They glitched me again. Okay, just end it. Why do I surround myself with the utterly incompetent? You Get bastards. Back in there and clear you them bastards. Out. You know what? I'm gonna switch out them or chaos now. Because maybe it causes that. This is a level where you lose landing bot resources and I got glitched out two times in a row. That's insane. That's insane. Okay. Freeze. Reloading creates a shockwave. That's worthless. That's actually worthless. Let's use this gun instead. Oh boy game. You're screwing me already. Wow, thanks for the boots. Re really appreciate it. Let's just charge him. Yep, yeah, that's cool. I definitely want to re lose resources on a level I could beat easily. Come in. Come up here. Come up here, bros. The best tactic with this would be to use the ability right before twisted down, twisted rounds end, and therefore save up on ammo. It's gonna reload anyways. So if you can time it perfectly, you're putting, you're releasing twisted rounds. The not damaging this. You're releasing the twisted round ability right when you have three shots left and then have a full magazine immediately. Also with shotguns like this it's pretty useful to have actually two twisted rounds as an ability. And slow trap all the way. Oh, that's it. No more ammo left. There's some gear, some gear. My English is already failing. Guess this is the last video I'm gonna do here for freeze again. Guess it just pulled me out of this mission. This SMG normally should freeze enemies really well. I'm doing it right now, there we go. And that's the big ability on this SMG. That's why I also kept it in the campaign. So if I if I die of the storm boss again, this might just save me a lot of time. I'm just gonna put a slow trap here so I can get my shield up when it ends. Which are so many abilities going on. Anyways, I didn't pull a mount tip. And I would have killed him easily already with a full of mount tip here. Come on, use it. Let's freeze him first. Freeze and burn and every effect. Nope, not this time. Oh, 
like crit, critical shots to that effect and I haven't gotten many of those god damn it snap actually got me that's insane I will farm main story headhunting and monster missions next oh. I have a feeling you might even get better loot from that. Do I do damage? I wasn't sure there. The marksman is skating. No sir you won't. Oh. Is he dying immediately? Oh yeah. Did so much damage on his back that he died immediately. Three shots. Just the bronze ability. Uh, here you go. Thank you for letting me charge. Uh, I am the wing of charge. I don't know if I should make trickster tactic videos. Since I've played trickster solo so many times and do know my stuff, but I feel like I just play slow trap with the rounds. Vanguard Judge, Hunter Bray anyways. So that's pretty much my Vanguard. My trickster tactic. Calling him Vanguard is my trickster tactic. Please don't freeze me this time. Exploding. All the explosions. Another snapper luring somewhere. Oh, this is gonna be an interesting fight up here. Oh, I'm in a corner. Put into my corner. This is my corner. There are many of corners. This one is mine. Yep. I'm gonna go back in my corner. Here's another corner. Oh, another big boy is coming to Let me... Come on, you... I was pressing the charge button the whole time. The tick glitch me again. That's just insane. How many times game? What the hell? Oh, I'm gonna lose all the landing pot resources here again. What the hell game? Well, thanks. Thanks, Outriders. Appreciate it. Get back in there and clear them out. Appreciate it. But you glitched me out three times during this expedition. And I have to abandon it. And lose like, all my resources. Good job. Good job. What the fucking hell. Seriously. Mm. Mm. I don't want to swear. Well, I'm gonna go work out anyways. A few... Yeah, yeah. I'm sorry. I'm, I guess I'm just not good enough. Don't they normally throw at you? The loot when you lose? Not this time. Not in here. No lost loot for me. Oh, cool. That's cool. How many resources did I lose? I don't know. I don't know. Guess I'm not gonna do... What was it called? The Marshall's Complex it was called. Guess I'm not gonna do that again because I'm just getting glitched out and screwed over. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I'm not gonna do expeditions anymore. This just ruined it for me. Bye.